Good evening to all of you. Hope that you are having a great day. It is good here. I want to show you. Hold on. Let me show you. Tonight is date night. Whoa! Look at these fancy new digs. They're not new. Well, the shirt's new. I bought it a long time ago, actually, but I was never able to fit into it until tonight. Well, and it's still a little tight, but you know what? We're making it work. We're making it work. We're making it work. And my wife, she, you're so pretty. Of course, you're always pretty. Oh, shucks. I, I'm okay. Look I at did, this. I did buy a new dress, okay? It looks so lovely. Let's make myself pretty. You're so pretty, baby. <laughs> this is not about me, though. We're celebrating you. Yeah, well, it may be about me, but... It's also just really nice to go on a date. It's just nice to go on a date. I mean, that's really exciting. Yeah, so we're gonna go because our reservations, uh, they're waiting, so. They're waiting on us. Right now, yeah. No, I'm kidding, we still have time. We still have time, but we gotta leave right now. Providence, which we love this little area. It's so nice and, yeah. and yeah. quaint. We're trying out Grill 29 tonight. It's supposed to be fancy, nice dining, so let's do this. Dinner was delicious. It was so good, wasn't it? It was just nice to go somewhere fancy, but it was really yummy. My, I just got a salad, but it was so tasty. My steak was really good as well. And you know what's hilarious? And we didn't even think about this until like a minute ago. Yeah, look, look, the place is called Grill Twenty Nine, <laughs> and he'll be twenty nine tomorrow. Wow, twenty nine years old, guys. This, this is gonna be the last year of my twenties. Wow, I got more to talk about later about that too. For some reason, we always end up at Bridge Street. I don't even, I don't know what it is. We just we just do. We end up at Bridge Street. This night, we actually, well, I went and got a popsicle. Mm -hmm. I had not. It had, was too cold for me to have a popsicle. I was yeah. not <laughs> dressed appropriately. <clears throat> I went for cuteness instead of um, practical, and but you're I so was pretty. frozen. You're so pretty you are. Stop. It's, She's so it's pretty. a pretty dress. I like the dress a lot. But my popsicle is really good, buttermilk, uh, which has dairy in it, which I was like, you know what? This is, I'm not usually one to it's have dairy. It's your birthday. But it's my birthday. It's so. almost your birthday. Yeah, the day you guys are watching this is my birthday. Mm -hmm. So it's also someone else's birthday. Oh, that's right. It's your birthday tomorrow. Did you realize that? Did you realize that? It's your birthday. Oh, yes. Yes, he does realize it. He realizes it indeed. <laughs> we do have a treat for him, and he will get it tomorrow. Fancy feast. Which one did we get? Did we? You got the turkey and gravy. That's that's my tastiest one. I like that one. Why are you on the couch, brother? Just because it's your birthday does not mean you can scratch up our furniture, buddy. He said actually, not. It does. He said actually, it's my furniture. Everything in here is mine, and I can scratch it up whenever I want. And this baby is over here. Oh, look at her. See, we told you she loves the basket. They both do. They both love this basket. Fancy feast aside, it was a fun date. I enjoyed it. And, you know, I really, I didn't want anything more than just going out to dinner, a nice dinner with my wife, getting a nice steak. Grill 29 wasn't the first place that we were thinking about going, but it ended up being excellent. Very tasty steak. The green beans were really good too. I was really impressed by those green beans. Rice pilaf, very tasty as well. And a salad, I had like a bite of the bacon with the vinaigrette on it. It was really good. And I have successfully worn out this shirt, I think. I think, like I mean wearing it outside. Never worn this one before. 
So it was very fitting that it was today. I mean, it's still a little tight, but uh, it worked. It worked. Birthday presents have been wrapped. Bedtime yoga has been completed. I think that means I'm good to go to bed, but I'm afraid to. <laughs> uh, but I will say, last night, I did finally sleep really well. Like I fell asleep before Randy and that hasn't happened in a week. Yeah, I was so, so I think that's a thankful. success. Oh, I was so thankful. I woke up feeling really refreshed. Yeah. If that means that I'm going to do nighttime yoga for the rest of my life, so be it. And I don't, I don't, think I don't know be. if it was the yoga though. It might have just been being act more active yesterday. Because I, I haven't that. really been active the last three weeks. So anyway, so I did yoga tonight and I took a back ride earlier today. So what I probably need to do tomorrow night is just not do the yoga, but do something active. And see if that still helps. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. So, but maybe we will do something fun and active tomorrow, hmm? Yeah, that'd be fun. Yeah, for your birthday? Oh yeah, that's tomorrow. It's, your, it's tomorrow, hmm? Huh? Yeah, I have a few things I want to talk about. So the day you're watching this is indeed my birthday. It's also the start of year four of our vlogs, which is pretty crazy to think about. It's also the 29th year, start of the 29th year of me being on this earth. And that is just mind blowing to me. The fact that I will be 29 years old tomorrow. I was thinking about it earlier and just thinking about what that means, that this is the last year of my 20s. There's a lot of things that go with that. Thoughts, blah, blah, blah. It comes down to this. I don't know if I've experienced all that I want to experience in my 20s. So I'm going to make my 29th year a year where I seek out new things and experience them. Nothing crazy, like I'm not gonna go jumping out of a plane or anything, I think. But I do want to take on some new things and try them out and see what I think about them. I'd love to learn to play piano. I don't know, that's just one of those things. I'd love to start trying to write some things, like a book maybe, or a song or something. I don't know, I'm putting myself out there just saying these are things that I want to try to do and I want to continue my fitness journey as well, my 29th year. All that to say, I want to enter my 30s as a well-rounded individual. I have a lot of likes and interests in my life, but I feel like a lot of those just sort of happened, or I wasn't very active, proactive in making that happen. You know, like my interests and my likes were just a byproduct of some circumstance of my life. I want to actively seek out things and try them out versus just happening. Skateboarding is a great example. I never would have been into skateboarding, um, but I started watching YouTube videos and other vloggers were skateboarding and I thought, that looks like fun, I want to try that. And now I do skateboarding. Very, very light, but I still do it. I want to find more things like that. Hey, did you have a fun date night? I did. It was really nice. Thanks for going with me. I didn't have a choice. No, not really. No, it was a lot of fun. I'm glad that we did it. The last date night was for our anniversary. In, on January 5th. Yeah, that's so, not a good record there. Well, our anniversary is the 6th, but we went on the 5th. But anyway, um, that's okay. Life has been kind of <laughs> hectic, crazy lately, so. It's not a great excuse, but no. we'll go with it. Yeah. And you know, I was talking about things I wanted to do. One thing I want to do with you is adventure more. And that, I think that includes dates. I think dates should be an adventure. I think so too. And I think we need to remember too, like, you know, our later in the afternoons are typically free for us. And so I feel like we should just go on more day adventures that don't cost a lot. I think that'd be a really fun goal for this year. Your last year in your 20s is to just make sure we do more fun day trips. Not even weekend trips or vacations. Just yeah. fun day trips. I agree. Make it so. Yeah. Adventuring with you is always fun. And just adventures in general is fun. and. You're gonna be 29. <laughs> uh, okay. It's yeah. It's already happened for them. So okay. Yeah. You'll be a great 29 year old though. I feel it in my bones. Well, thanks. I wouldn't want any other 28 year old with me. <laughs> At least until November. <laughs> thanks. No. Then you have to upgrade to a 29 year old. Hope you guys have enjoyed your ride. We have enjoyed our ride today. It was a fun date night. Really didn't do too much after dinner, just walked around Bridge Street, but it was still fun. Just being with this lady is fun. And being fancy. And being fancy. We and felt so fancy. fancy in our fancy clothes. Yeah. So uh, tomorrow's gonna be a fun day though. 
I'm excited. I don't know what all we're gonna do, but I, th yeah. I think I have a few tricks up my sleeve, so. Do you? I do. Well. With the help of someone else, maybe. I don't know if I agree about that. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Tune in. Love you guys, hope you've enjoyed your ride. God bless. God bless. Happy start of year four. Oh yeah. Happy vlog anniversary.